Hello everyone, and welcome back to my short 12 day series where I go over my 12 favourite games of all time. As this is the 19th of December, I'll be going over my 7th favourite game of all time, which is Football Manager, and specifically Football Manager 2018. Football Manager 2018 is one of those very in-depth simulation games all about football or soccer if you're American and you have no idea how many hours I have put into all of the football manager games that I've owned. Probably about 2,000 in total because the games are so in-depth. Every single player that plays football in, the f in any league you can imagine has been scouted out by someone hired by football manager to get accurate stats to make sure that the game is as realistic as possible. But it also means as you're controlling and managing these teams, you can accomplish anything. You can take one of the worst sides in the world and take them to win the best the best trophy you can win. You know, you could take a, a fourth-tier Belgium side to win the Champions League. You could take Honduras to win the World Cup. You, you can do anything you could put your mind to. It's absolutely brilliant. I would recommend this game if you're even the slightest bit interested in football slash soccer because it does it can seem scary at first because it does look just like a lot of spreadsheets a lot of watching things happen but there's so you can do the tiniest of tweaks to your tactics and that makes the world of difference between you winning 7-0 and losing 2-1 out of 10 I would probably give this game about a 9 because it's so in depth I mean, they don't necessarily change over the years, like maybe new skins, more up-to-date stats, of course, but the actual mechanics of the game are, is so unique to Football Manager, and you've got to give them credit for that. But no, thank you for watching the sixth episode of this. Join me tomorrow where I will go over my sixth favourite game. But until then, goodbye for now.